Hello, I'm Shannon and I'm a vocal coach here at School of Rock in Columbia, Maryland. And we are discussing today how to sing Thriller by Michael Jackson, which is maybe the greatest song in the history of all songs ever. Um, my student Jace. is in the R&B royalty band here and they are doing Aretha Franklin and Michael Jackson and Prince and everybody good. Um, so I just kind of wanted to talk about how you go about learning a song and kind of dissecting the details of it. Um, because we're kind of at the beginning of the season here, but Thriller is probably going to be one of the, our big songs that we perform. So we're going to talk a little bit about this. Um, so in the beginning ambient kind of video part with all this stuff, um, we determined that the bass line here happens how many times? Four times, so there's four measures. Four, two, three, four. It's close to midnight. It's close to people working in the dark. Under the moonlight, you see a sight that almost off your heart. You start to scream. But there are things that some people can make it. Okay, keep going. You start to breathe. As horror goes to my feet through the eyes, you'll never lie. Okay. So before we get to the chorus, let's talk a little bit about this first verse. First, wow, first verse. So our first lyric is, it's close to midnight, right? And the first little thing we come across is, it's close to midnight, night, that little run. And Jace and I have been working quite a bit on, on runs, um, but this is a quick little ditty. So how we're going to start to work on this is we're going to take the syllable ah, because that's in this diphthong, diphthong being two vowel sounds next to each other, midnight. So the diphthong is I, but we're going to isolate that ah sound and ah, and build up speed on that little run. So with me now, go taking a good breath. Ah, a little bit faster. Good. Now we're going to go. Uh, ah, so. Ah, ah, ah. Right. So we're just taking little bits of that. And of course, we would spend a little bit more time on it. And I don't expect her to sing this perfectly right now because it's a work in progress. And we just got this song. Um, so that's our first little bit. And then we have another one at something evil's lurking in the dark. So the other part is we're not going to lay too hard on that R. Dark. We're not going to do that because that's it's all about the vowel sounds. Something evil's lurking in the dark. So there's almost no er. Dark. The er comes at the very end. Um, okay, so let's do that again. Paying attention to those. Lighten up a little bit on those. So... Um, close to midnight. Okay. It's a little bit easier when you lighten up on them. Um, and then the other thing is just these big vowel sounds. Midnight. We want to have a lot of space in the back of our mouth, okay? So we get that by opening the mouth wider and paying attention to um, the modifications of some of these vowels. So let's try this again. Um, you start to freeze. Right. Um, and we've got a bunch of those little runs. Uh, they just happen at different notes. And so our next one, do you start to freeze? But terror takes a sound. And then we talked about kind of the contour of that line. Um, and terror looks you right between the eyes. You're paralyzed, right? So he kind of gets a little bit quieter, comes down a little bit. And then you're paralyzed. Like, oh my God, you're paralyzed. Like you have to consider the shape of the lyric. Okay, so that's the shape of it right there. All right, let's do it again from the beginning. So we got this little bit. Let's count here, the bass line. And then we, remember we hear that chord right before we start.
Here we go, chords. It's so Beautiful. Something evil lurking in the dark. Under the moonlight. The effect that almost lost it hard. You start to scream. But there it takes to sound before you make it. You start to breathe. A little bit quieter. As long as you see the eyes, you'll paralyze. Cause this is it. Feel like night. And no one's gonna save it. So we need to stop the flash. Yeah, feel like Beautiful. Okay. So we got through it. Your runs are a little bit better. Keep practicing those. Um, lightening up on them is going to help a lot. Now let's talk about the chorus, okay? I liked your contour of the line when you did um, horror. Is it horror or terror? It looks you right between the eyes. I can't remember. It looks you right between the eyes. Uh, you're paralyzed, cause this is thriller. I sang the wrong notes. Cause this is thriller. That's another instance where we have to have a big open vowel sound. Cause this is thriller, right? Yeah. R, thriller. And again, don't lay on those those R sounds too hard in the in the middle. So, um, uh. Air. This is thriller. Yeah. Thriller. Thriller night. Right. Um. Fight and fight and live inside a killer thriller tonight. Another line that builds, okay? Killer thriller tonight. So let's do that um that chorus one more time. Uh, thriller, thriller night. And no, not no no hard T sounds either. Um, because again, we have another diphthong here. Diphthong being two vowel sounds gliding together. Night. So the E, night, not hard on the E, hard on the, not hard. We're laying more on the A. Thrill, thriller, thriller, night. Okay, let's do that chorus again. Actually, the pre chorus and the chorus. Okay, you start to freeze here. As far as looks you right between the eyes, you'll paralyze. Cause this is thriller, thriller of night. And no one's gonna save it from the beast of the sky. Thriller, thriller of night. You're fighting for your life inside of uh, thriller, uh. thriller tonight. Yeah, and that's another run that we're, that's a work in progress. Tonight, um, but she's getting those high notes, and she's getting the high notes because we practiced blending head and chest voice together. Um, so we're we're really achieving a, a pretty good mix there. Of course, we're always practicing that, but we're achieving a a good a good mix. So with those high notes, um, you need to kind of build up to them, and there's a variety of ways to do this. One one way to make them a little bit easier is to make sure you have enough space in your mouth. Um, another way is to do sliding exercises up to them. Um, so the line is, cause this is thriller. So we're gonna go. So we're gonna do a slide to and from that note. So go. And Jace is kind of also using the front of her face. Instead of sending it back here, oh, we don't want that kind of sound for this song, right? We want, ah, and we can achieve that by making a mm sound first, like an NG, and really activating our resonator. So, mm, mm, ah. so to give me an, uh, mm, by yourself now. Very good. Okay, so that's kind of how we can access those those high notes. And of course, that was very quick. I don't 
that's not like a full lesson or tutorial, but that's just how we start to kind of figure out songs like this. So um, again, just a, just a little beginning piece of the verse, a pre-chorus and a, and a chorus of how we dissect songs um, here and how we get started on them and how we practice them. So thank you, Jace, for being the test subject. Um, and thank you guys for watching.